Australia's MQ-28A Ghost Bat, an unmanned combat aerial vehicle developed under Project Air 7003, has emerged as a transformative force in the nation's defense landscape, with a series of groundbreaking advancements in 2024 and 2025. On Saturday, June 21st, 2025, Defense Australia announced a historic milestone. The Ghost Bat conducted its first flight outside the restricted Woomera training area during Exercise Carlsbad. This flight, executed at a remote airfield, demonstrated the aircraft's ability to operate autonomously beyond its traditional testing grounds, showcasing robust flight controls, sensor fusion, and return to base procedures. Described emphatically as the Flight of the Ghost Bat by Defense Australia, this achievement marks a pivotal step toward operational readiness, solidifying Australia's position as a leader in modern air combat capabilities. As the first military aircraft designed and built in Australia in over 50 years, the Ghost Bat, developed in partnership with Boeing, represents a bold stride towards sovereign air power. The stealth-enabled UKV is engineered to function as a loyal wingman, operating alongside crewed Royal Australian Air Force platforms, such as the F-35A Joint Strike Fighter, F-A-18F Super Hornet, and future next-generation air combat systems. By extending sensor coverage, enhancing situational awareness, and providing additional lethality without risking human pilots, the Ghost Bat redefines Australian air doctrine. This shift marks a departure from decades of reliance on foreign-supplied aircraft, which primarily focused on transport, training, and surveillance roles, rather than indigenous fighter class designs. The successful flight during Exercise Carlsbad underscores growing confidence in the Ghost Bat's advanced systems, bringing it closer to seamless integration with crewed assets. The Ghost Bat's development has accelerated significantly with over 100 test flights completed by March 2025, supported by more than 20,000 hours of digital testing. The Capability Demonstration 2025 has been a focal point, with the RAF and Boeing conducting tests to validate the Ghost Bat's manned-unmanned teaming capabilities. A standout trial involved two Ghost Bats, alongside a digitally simulated unit controlled by an E-7 Wedgetail airborne early warning aircraft, demonstrating sophisticated coordination. Upcoming tests in late 2025 will pair the Ghost Bat with F-A-18F Super Hornets and F-35As, further proving its operational viability. Boeing has also planned a live air-to-air -air missile test by the end of 2025 or early 2026, a critical milestone toward combat readiness, with air-to-ground testing slated for future phases. These tests highlight the Ghost Bat's versatility as a multi-role platform capable of adapting to diverse mission requirements. Production advancements are propelling the program forward. Three Block II Ghost Bats featuring enhanced wings and improved GPS ENS systems for greater survivability in contested environments are under construction and expected to be completed by December 2025. These will complement the eight Block I prototypes currently used for testing. In February 2024, the Australian government committed 399 million Australian dollars to advance sensors, mission payloads, integrated combat systems, and autonomous teaming technologies. This funding also supports a new 9,000 square meter production facility in Toowoomba, Queensland, developed in partnership with Wagner Corporation. Set to be operational by 2027, this facility will enable scaled production of the Ghost Bat marking Boeing's first such site outside the United States and reinforcing Australia's industrial capacity. The Ghost Bat's strategic importance extends beyond national borders, fostering international collaboration and interest. Under the 2023 US-Australia Collaborative Combat Aircraft Agreement, the United States has been testing a Ghost Bat since 2023, with the U.S. Navy expressing strong interest in its potential as a model for its own CCA program. 
While the Navy prioritizes cheaper, disposable drones, discussions for U.S. procurement persist, alongside interest from other Five Eyes nations, including the United Kingdom, under AUKUS Pillar 2. However, the Ghost Bat faces competition from platforms like Andril's Fury Drone, which leverages commercial technology for cost efficiency. Although not selected for the U.S. Air Force's CCA Increment 1, Boeing is positioning the Ghost Bat for Increment 2 and other international markets, emphasizing its advanced autonomy and combat capabilities. Training initiatives are also advancing, with Wing Commander Phil Parsons becoming the first RAF remote systems pilot to complete Boeing's training program in June 2024, mastering launch, recovery, and basic maneuvers. A U.S. Navy pilot graduated concurrently, reflecting deepening Allied integration. The Ghost Bat program, with an investment of approximately 1 billion Australian dollars for 13 aircraft, is a cornerstone of Australia's defense strategy amid rising Indo-Pacific tensions. Air Vice Marshal Nick Hogan has hailed the platform as world-class, underscoring its role in shaping future air combat through autonomous teaming. The flight outside Woomera during Exercise Carlsbad not only demonstrates technical progress, but also signals Australia's ambition to lead in aerospace autonomy. The Ghost Bat's development is a testament to Australia's growing defence innovation ecosystem. Project Air 7003 has revitalised the nation's aerospace industry, creating hundreds of jobs and fostering partnerships with local suppliers. The Toowoomba facility, for instance, is expected to employ over 350 skilled workers, boosting Queensland's economy and establishing a hub for advanced manufacturing. Moreover, the program's emphasis on cutting-edge technologies, such as artificial intelligence, sensor fusion, and secure data links, positions Australia as a key player in the global defense technology race. The Ghost Bat's ability to operate in contested environments, supported by its stealth features and autonomous systems, aligns with the RAF's vision of a networked, fifth-generation Air Force capable of deterring potential adversaries. Strategically, the Ghost Bat enhances Australia's deterrence posture in a region marked by geopolitical uncertainty. Its ability to conduct high-risk missions such as intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance and strike operations without endangering pilots offers a cost-effective solution to modern warfare challenges. The platform's export potential further amplifies its significance, with interest from allies signaling trust in Australia's defence capabilities. However, challenges remain, including balancing cost competitiveness against rivals like Fury and ensuring the Ghost Bat systems remain interoperable with evolving allied platforms. Continued investment in research and development will be critical to maintaining its technological edge.